Hello from Bear River. Today is March 1st, 2024. The flow is currently increasing substantially. It's up to almost 1,500 cubic feet per second. It was down to like 700 and 600. So in a day, it's come up that much and I'm thinking it's gonna come up some more. I'm down a little ways because I was uh, drumming and praying for the river because these are tough times for Bear River and I would encourage everyone to say a prayer for the bear. We're getting to the end of an era and we're hoping that it will be the end of the proposed Centennial Dam. Everybody needs to push for that to be over and this river to move on toward restoration and restitution for the damage that's been done to this river, as is evidenced in this very cobble field with the devastation, the Holocaust of the hydraulic mining. I just saw a book that was written about the historic flows. And at one point, the water was thick and black with mud and the river filled completely up and didn't flow at all after 1860. And the only time it flowed was on the weekends when the miners weren't taking all the water. What do you think, a river being treated like that? And uh, this cobble is starting to flood, which happens when the flow gets up over around 2,000. And um, last year it got to 5,000 and even 8,000. So maybe this year we'll be lucky again and the flow will go up. Right now you can see the flow the water encroaching on the cobble field pretty good. And I'll try to come back later, but I wanted to get a break in the storm. It's supposed to storm, today is Friday. It's supposed to storm through Sunday and into Monday. So um, we might get some uh, big totals on up the hill that will eventually come down Bear River. And right here I was noticing the water now the little uh, rim dam, it's an indentation because the water is coming over it, down and rebounding back up. So it'll be interesting to see what becomes of that. And then we can see the tip of the island over there that will probably be underwater soon because the water is climbing at a very steep rate and I don't think it's topped out yet. So uh, there should be pretty good, this is a river that's coming up. This is a river rising. Right now, the waters are rising from the precipitation in the upper watershed. Okay, here we are on a brisk and beautiful, invigorating day with our living river, sending living water down to the sea. Rollins is spilling, Combi is spilling, Camp Far West is spilling, and Bear River living water is carrying its energy from the headwaters all the way down to the Feather, to the Sacramento, through the Delta, and into the sea, where the water cycle is completed. The water goes around to the sea, not down, around, because it is part of a great circle, the circle of life. The water cycle is a circle, and this is our part in the circle, keeping the wheels going. May the circle be unbroken. Mani Wachoni, water is life.